begin here at 1230 with a big announcement that may give the green light to rapid transit in Indianapolis. Eyewitness News reporter Chris Kirshner tells us what's happening today and what it means for the daily commute. Now at Meridian and Vermont streets is one of the many Indigo bus stops around the city of Indianapolis. You know, Indigo, our main source of transit, but there's for years been talk of a rapid transit system that might come to Indianapolis. Well, now it looks like there's been some movement on that, what's called the red line. Now, here's a little bit about the red line. What are the routes for bus rapid transit here in the city that's been planned and talked about for a while now? A 28-mile route running from Westfield to Greenwood. Think of it as light rail on wheels. The buses using dedicated lanes, running every five minutes or so and stopping about every half mile. You board from a platform. You pay before you board at a pay station. Well, the city now getting a $2 million grant from the Department of Transportation to get the plans for this line rolling. It's the route that has the most potential for economic development. So that's that's the piece, the, the, the south to north, north to south route. Has a tremendous potential, has a lot of the employment centers across, the, has the schools across the line. And so, and so the uh, transit-oriented development that would be along the line is, is potentially huge. A spokesman for the city tells me that the uh, federal funding, that $2 million, will be used for the design and engineering of this plan. There are public meetings. They continue about the transit plan, and some of those will continue this week. It may be that this red line is built in phases. Right now, we're not sure the timeline of construction. It is, again, just in the planning development phases, but still a big step forward for transit here in the city of Indianapolis. We're going to learn more about this at a press conference later this afternoon with Mayor Ballard and some mayors from other uh, local communities that stand to benefit. So we'll be sure to follow that up. In the meantime, you can get more information about the red line, about the transit system plan for Indianapolis on our website at WTHR.com. Reporting downtown, Chris Kirshner, Channel 13 Eyewitness News.